Hello and welcome to The Sacred Path. Today I want to talk to you about open doors. Listen to the words of the Apostle Paul in Colossians chapter 4, verse 2. Devote yourselves to prayer, keeping alert in it with an attitude of thanksgiving, praying at the same time for us as well, that God will open up to us a door for the word, so that we may speak forth the mystery of Christ, for which I am also being imprisoned, that I may make it clear in the way I ought to speak. Now, the book of Colossians is one of the uh, prison epistles. So Paul was in prison at the time he wrote this. So I could just see this uh, prayer meeting at Colossae. Hey, brothers, let's, sisters, let's come together. Let's pray for Paul. Now, Paul would have an open door to communicate Christ. To who? To prisoners. To who? To the prison guards. See, it doesn't matter where you're at, what your circumstance is. You should always look for the open door, for that open door to share the name of Jesus in. So that's a prayer that I pray for myself often, that I might have open doors on a daily basis. I also pray for my brothers and sisters in Christ, that God will open doors for them, that the name of Jesus might be able to walk right through. So today, take time, pray for the open door, and expect it to be open.